spiritual white fire. Wild fire is uncontrollable fire. Fire that burns strongly out of control. A large, contagious, destructive fire that can spread quickly. When we say a fire is wild, it cannot be curtailed. You can't stop it. You can't quench it. You can't cop it. The Bible says as soon as Solomon built the altar and the temple, he made a sacrifice to the Lord and a fire came down from heaven. A fire came down. It, it was not only Elijah that called down fire. Solomon pulled down fire by sacrifice. There is a point you get to in your life that man will no longer answer you but God will be the one that will begin to answer you. In Exodus chapter 3 verse 2 a man called Moses saw the burning bush. The Bible said there was fire on the bush but the bush was not consumed. Can I prophesy to somebody here? There is a kind of fire that is about to rest on your life. Do I have some prophetic bush here? You are about to attract men. You are about to attract glory. And whatever you are going through will not consume you. Uh, the louder the amen, the quicker a miracle is about to happen. If your fire can be controlled by men, they will kill you. Now, hear me. Hear me. I don't care anybody who talks about you or does not love you. But if your fire is not under their control, they can't stop you. But if their fire is under their control, they will kill it. You don't get me. Now, why I'm talking about white fire, when I hear somebody say, this little light of mine, no, you don't need little light. You need floodlight. You don't get me. You don't need little light. As long as there was a man that lights this light, there is a man that can quench this light. You are not getting me? The reason why you have not gone where you are supposed to enter in ministry is because a man is behind your light. Spiritual white fire. The fire upon our life did not come as a result of a man. It came as a result of God. Who can battle with the Lord? Who has commanded a thing that God has not said? Who has said a thing that God has not commanded? Am I talking to somebody here? For there is no divinity, neither enchantment against Israel. What then shall we then say in all this? If God be for us, who then can be against us? Ladies and gentlemen, I am tired of small, small light. I am tired of small, small light. Hey, 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 hey. The capacity of your light will determine the frequency of your flight. I said the capacity of your light will determine the frequency of your flight. Can I talk to somebody here? You cannot eat like an elephant and poo poo like a rat. The question is, what kind of fire are you carrying? One little gossip, you have left church. One little storm, you have backslided. Because your light is a candle light, it's a lamp light. The question is, what kind of fire are you carrying? I'm asking the question, little trouble, your body has melted down. What kind of fire? There are sons that cannot stand by their father because they don't understand prayer. Let me move with the candlelight. Follow me as you are moving. What? If you carry this kind of fire, follow me, stand behind me. Line up behind me. No, you stay there. If you carry this kind of fire, no matter how you try to protect it, the more as I'm moving, move, the more you are advancing, 
something will be following the light. The more you'll be trying to use your own hand to protect the light because it's a man made light. Keep following me because it's a man made. Keep following me. The more you advance, the light will be shaken. The more you advance, the light will be shaken. The more you advance, what has happened? Because the light cannot enter the next level. There is a kind of fire that you carry that cannot enter the next level. You need another kind of fire. Shana mana, shana mana mana. Father, I am tired of this level. I want to enter the next level. I am tired of this level. I want to enter the next level. I don't know where they kept you, but I hear one fire. I hear one fire. I hear one fire. I hear one fire. Spiritual white fire. Did anybody quench this fire? But their advancement, their movement, begin to make the fire to shake. There are some of you, you cannot stay under a leader because your light of understanding is myopic, pinchonic, and microscopic. The mystery of the lamp is this. Watch this. This kind is determined by the amount of oil here. Once the supplier of the oil cut it off, the light goes off. And if this person is surrounded by enemies, they can open the lantern or flood the oil inside and cock it back. Now, do you know why you need wildfire? This kind of fire, when it starts burning, within one hour, it would have achieved what it wants to achieve overnight you don't get me one number one when the fire start burning nobody draws near everybody begin to go far that means the fire itself carry a security code god need to set your life on fire so that when your enemies see you they are far how do i know i wildfire when people that are close to me begin to run away from me it simply means they cannot stand my fire Saul was going on the way and the Bible says he met a greater light on the way not as if he does not have light but the light was lesser light he met a greater light and by meeting the greater light went blind. There are people glory that can make people go into permanent kumatus. Oh, you don't get me. God is about to do something for you. That that local champion that think is raining, your light is about to silence that light. You are not hearing me. Maybe you are not getting what I'm saying. Some people think they are rich. But as soon as you arrive, your weight is about to swallow their own. Saul had light, but he saw a greater light. Pastors, can I talk to some of you here? Do you know why, why you are under attack? You are carrying a greater light. You don't get me. Where you see people seeing you from afar and they are throwing stone and they don't want you to come closer and they are attacking you. They cannot stand the frequency, the potency, the propensity of your fire. Can I talk to somebody here? Can I talk to somebody here? There is a fire that is about to come. There is an army that is about to come. Some of them might be in the village, but they are about to shine in this end time. There is a leader, uh, some group of leaders are about to rise up. Either politicians, uh, business guru, uh, end time 
financier. They are about to rise up from the church. Are they hearing the sound of my voice? You are about to rise up. Some white fire are coming. They are coming. They are coming. They are coming. Shut fire. Spiritual white fire.